Hey guys, this video is just about cleaning apart. Um, I don't know, I just like to, when I put the bikes back together, just try to clean them and make them look as good as possible. Um, and every little bit of it, it really works. When you clean this and that before you know it, when you're done, everything's looking really, really good. So here's the throttle, kill switch, throttle housing. And you can see it's grungy. It's never been cleaned ever, probably. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it real quick in real time. And let's see what it looks like when I get done. And I finally bit the bullet and bought a real JIS screwdriver set. A whole set actually. So, I always use Phillips head and it does, these do bite better, there's no doubt about it. Japanese industrial screwdriver, JIS. Pretty clean inside. But I'll actually hit it with some, with some uh, electrical cleaner. I just happen to have some. Here's my little brush, little nylon brush. This is uh, Simple Green. On a lot of the bikes that I do, I'll clean these parts and then I'll bring them over to the buffing wheel and I'll buff them and it just brings it, they just glow. Now, I don't know if I'll do that on this one or not. I just want to get it clean. We'll see what it looks like once I get it clean. Water. looking better but get these screws out of here and take it apart and get down in those little cracks and crevices a little bit better kind of messy but it's worth it yeah look at that filthy down in there no bueno. Hard to get down in there. At some point, somebody greased this. Maybe it was sticking. And a, a lot of times, they will stick but I find it's the handlebar is rusted underneath the tube and it doesn't slide very well. So take that off and hit that with steel wool or file or whatever you need to do. Here's another thing I use some guys are these little Q-tips. They get into all these little spots. I got these from Harbor Freight. They're all different sizes. I don't know how many. There's a whole bunch. hundred or so. But, I mean, they're cheap. But they work. They get into all those little spots. Okay. Set off. My hands are dirtier now than the part. I'm gonna wipe the gloves off. I'll show you what I'm talking about here. 
And then as the bike progresses, I'll take other pictures. When we're done, it's almost back together. Well, it's just a couple minutes, you know. It's well worth it since you got the bike torn apart anyway. All right, I'm gonna continue on with it. Don't wanna bore you guys too much. Thanks a lot, take care. Thanks for subscribing and hit the like button and comment if you'd like. Appreciate it. Take care, guys.